Yo, let's get a Richard the Cruz. It's your boy DJ Nuki, your girl. Sierra Cole. We're back on the channel with another. Back on the channel with another reaction. Back on the channel with another. Get and see original. Yeah. <laughs> welcome, welcome back to the channel, man. If y'all back with new to the channel, just simply haven't done so already. Go ahead, please let the lovely people know what to do. Make sure that you like, comment, share, and subscribe. And don't forget to turn on your post notifications so that you're always on the phone when upload a new video. Yep, that's right. Also, check out the links in the description box down below. You already know where to go. Go ahead, go over there to the main channel, show us some love, support, peace, and positivity as well. Socials right there. Mm -hmm. Do what do what you're supposed to do with that. Make <laughs> some shade. But today we got five scary things caught on camera in the woods. Mm -hmm. Like like to go outside in the woods at night. No, baby. You don't even like one in the front row. <laughs> You like the wood. Uh -huh. Every time you come out, come in from walking on my side, and now you laugh. I swear I saw something. I'm not. I swear I saw some little tree. <laughs> I see some every night. Bro. I hear stuff. You like get the time. <laughs> Especially when he's telling you he ran the block. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh man. <laughs> With that being said, man, let's go ahead and get into it. Let's go ahead and check it out. Let's see what it's about. You ready? I'm ready. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Five scary things caught on camera in the woods. Not a happy camper. The YouTube channel Project Amber follows the travel exploits of a British guy named CJ and his dog Lance. Basically, CJ travels to bizarre and remote locations all over Europe and camps there in his van for several nights. Okay. Project Amber is a very entertaining travel channel, but is not paranormal in the least. In fact, there's not one video on the channel that contains anything remotely supernatural. Okay. Except for this one video. CJ is camped out in a very remote area of the French countryside. He's trying to fix his camper fridge, when suddenly his dog Lance, who is just off screen, starts to act very strange. Right. I'm sure with house fridges you're supposed to camp. Right, so I'm pretty sure with a house fridge, if you move it, you're supposed to leave it like 12 or 24 hours. So I'm going to give it the full 24 hours, I think, to work. What are you looking at? You keep freaking me out, John. There's no one over there. Stop, <laughs> stop, stop doing that, man. I'm seeing some hot stuff. CJ then reveals why the dog's behavior is giving him the creeps. There's actually a well. Just where I'm parked, you go down this little track, and there's a well with a big metal bar on it. And uh, I reached out, I was going to go and park there, and I saw the well. Instantly started thinking about the ring, which when I was mm -hmm. about, I think it was about 10 when it came out, and scared the s out of me. But like, I'm. That's one movie I don't, me I don't mess with certain movies, bro. <laughs> that is one I don't mess with, bro. It's the ring, bro. Hey, sorry, you just got to let, let, let yeah. me in. <laughs> I didn't sleep properly. And now the dog keeps looking over in that direction of where it is. So I'm like, no, oh, mate, I might move. <laughs> right. But I can't. That evening, as the sun begins to set, things get even more bizarre. Okay, I'm seriously freaked out now. Um, a minute ago, I could hear, like, really loud moaning, like, oh. Like just booming across the mountains, so I've come down to where I could hear it. I uh, got to this old well, and it oh. stopped. I mean, that thing's wild freaky. So it's smart the ring. But just as soon as I got here, just from over there, there's no track or anything. It's just wood. This girl appeared, dressed like kind of like a monk. Uh, no shoes, and no hair. So I said bonjour, and that she was responded. Um, asked if she was okay, but she didn't respond. Then she just carried on walking. Um, so I carried on a bit and thought, I better double check. Went to go and find her again. She's gone. So up that way, that's where my van is. And that goes to the road. Oh, no. Down where she went that way, there's nothing. And there's nothing for miles. Where did she go? Baby, well, I will be going. I'm going to leave. Right. CJ says that his dog Lance usually happily runs over to meet new people. But the Spaniel wouldn't go anywhere near the bizarre bald girl. A little later, CJ spots the girl again. He records her in the distance, aimlessly walking through the countryside woods. Something going on. Look at her. 
about it. CJ says she saw the girl fair, again but... later, but didn't have the chance to record. Uh, I saw the girl another two times. The last time I was near the van and she was running through the forest. And with that, CJ has had enough. Mm -hmm. He just gets out of there. I booted it. I'm about 50 miles from there now, but I left. I was gone. I was gone so fast. I didn't even pack the van away. Um, yeah, yeah. She's a fell out it's a pretty big mess in here. So, did CJ have a run in with a ghost in the remote French countryside? Let me know what you think. It might not even been a ghost. It might just been somebody out here trying to kill, though. I ain't even gonna say trying to kill. You just, just don't know what's going you know, on in the world. Maybe world's. they, maybe it's a family. Or well, somebody, well, somebody trying to kidnap you. You mm. never know. That was stupid. It rings a bell. On the channel Mind Seed TV, the guys are trekking through the woods late at night to find an abandoned, supposedly haunted group of buildings deep in the forest. But on their hike through the woods, they encounter something much scarier than a ghost. Someone seems to be following them in the dark. Hell no. Look, that's one, that's one there. Yeah. Hey, cool. 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 A person whistles from somewhere in the trees. Nevertheless, the guys keep going and eventually reach their destination, an abandoned building deep in the forest. They are now suspicious that someone might be stalking them through the woods. They set up a makeshift warning system using bells attached to fishing line to alert them if someone approaches. So we got the whole area lined now with fishing strength and bells. Jones are all the way around this whole building. So that way, uh, anything approaches us, any kind of direction, we'll be able to see it. So now we're going to go inside and we're going to set up the cameras. What's that, dude? What's up? That wasn't like a little branch break. That's fing That's fing scary. I didn't believe fing bear theory. I said we're in the building. Let's do what we have to do in Spain, all right? We already have the parameters set up now. So, whatever that was, if it gets close, that was worse than the whistle. We'll hear the bells. Yeah, that was worse. That was worse than the whistle. We'll the bells. Let's hear the bells. I'll do they perform their here. usual parapsychology tests and get a few odd results, but nothing much. So, they decide to leave. Then, this happens. All right, so we just finished all our sessions in there. Unfortunately, uh, we're not really sure if we did find anything. I don't think that we did. We're going to review a lot of it in the video editing program. Uh, we did get a little bit lost off track, but I think that we're on the right path now. And I would say we're probably about uh, we're probably about 10 minutes to the road. Is it pocket? Yeah. Yeah. Now it's in my pocket. Grab it. Let's start moving. Let's move. Let's move. Let's move. That was there from the f***ing bell. That was the f***ing bell. Oh, no. I don't want anything creeping up on us. No. I really don't want anything creeping up on us. This is the most uncomfortable I've probably ever been in my whole entire life. Do you hear a little crackle? Why are we stopping? Why are we stopping? I don't know, dude. That sounded close. You know what? I said we'd hurry up a little bit. Yeah, get out of here. Fuck you. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> hey, hey, I'm with you, bro. No, hey. that's what we're right here. Well, the man, he's been trying to like play it cool. Play it cool. He ain't trying to panic the other dude, but I'm the other dude, baby. <laughs> Gotta get the hell on out of here. We should have been there. Someone <laughs> walks over their warning line, causing the bells to jingle. They make a run for it and get back to their car safely, but the two are still very shaken up hmm. by the whole ordeal. Cut the camera off for a minute. I really needed to figure out where we were going, and uh, we needed to get out of there quickly because uh, I'm pretty sure we were being followed just now. The whistle. That means two things to me. One, you had to have known that we were there, or heard us, seen us, and lives, like whatever. Yeah. And two, just confident up the whistles, knowing like, yo, nothing's gonna happen to me. 
You can watch the full video True. as well as their other paranormal investigations over True. on Mind C TV. Hey. Hide and seek. Oh, no. This next clip is one of those obscure videos that's been on the internet for years, but not too many people have seen it. I would say. Now, the story goes that a guy named Mike had been seeing something walking near the tree line of the woods that surround his home. One night, he decides to grab a flashlight and go to investigate. I don't say I ain't doing that, man. What the? You see that? I was looking at you. Oh, shit. So this is a pretty old video, and even though I researched, I can't even confirm the original source. Mm -hmm. But it's definitely creepy, and I don't know what that is. Mm -hmm. So is it a real creature caught on camera, or just a fake? Mm -hmm. As always, you decide. Uninvited guest. On the German YouTube channel <laughs> iBlolly, these three guys, Tony, Vic, and Nia, are exploring a supposedly haunted abandoned hotel. They are all alone in the deep woods surrounding the building. And as you might expect, they're a bit nervous. Yo, I have something to say. I have no idea what's going on. There was one. The trio catches some creepy noises, but not much else. Or at least that's what they thought. When they posted the video online, viewers noticed something absolutely chilling. Now keep in mind when you watch this clip that there were only three guys exploring the hotel, and they were all alone, miles into the forest. Did you see it? <laughs> One of the guy's cameras accidentally catches what looks to be someone just standing there, motionless in the dark, watching them. Oh, no. They posted a follow-up video soon after. If you can speak a little German, you can check out the full paranormal investigation of the haunted hotel in the woods over on the iBlolly YouTube channel. As always, thanks for watching. I ain't got, I ain't got to check out. I got enough information there. I don't need none else. But we're going to leave it right there. Y'all have a good one with that one. Mm -hmm. Man, but hey, y'all always say y'all love these, man. So make sure y'all continue to spam those up in the comment section down below. Let us know your favorite one so we can make sure we check it out on the... So we can make sure we check it out on the channel, man. Y'all oh. know what to do with that, man. <laughs> Don't quit coming for me, man. But as always, y'all know how it go, man. I do go by the name DJ Nikki. This is. See you in the house. We are. We are, y'all.